we'll guide you through how to make a video sound in your iPhone ringtone. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. Here we have the video which I wish to go and make into a ringtone. So first of all, we need to go and separate and extract the audio from this. To go and do this, we are going to go and need an app. And the app we're going to use is just an MP3 converter. So I just went on the app store. I went in search for MP3 converter, but you can go and use other ones as well. They should all pretty much do the same thing. So now let's go and open it up just like this. And we'll just quickly go through the app. There is the option to get the paid version of the app, but for now I'll just go and use the free one and I'll go and close off this. I'll then click on the plus button at the bottom and then I need to go and click on import from camera roll. You'll need to allow access to your camera roll and then select the video you want to go and extract it from. I'll then go and press add in the bottom right and then click on it and then scroll down until you go and see the option for convert and go and click on it and it'll then start circling and then what you can do is go and press on export and you'll go and see this sort of share screen and then what you can do is as you can see it's now an audio recording you want to go down and click on save to files just like this and go and save it somewhere you can easily go and find it so i'm going to go and save it here i'll press save and there it is next you're going to go and need an app to then go and make this audio file into a ringtone and that app is GarageBand. As you can see, here it is. You can get it from the App Store for free. Just go and open the App Store and search for it and then open it up. In GarageBand, you need to go and find Audio Recorder. And here it is. You may need to swipe across a few times and then go and click on it. And then what you need to do is at the top here, go and click on this blue icon. This is like a tapping sound, which you don't need. After you've done that, then go and click on that plus icon in the top right. And the song section screen will open up. Go and press on section A and just make sure automatic is turned on and then go and press done. And then go over to the left and you need to go and press on this but this icon here. It's sort of got different layers of different lines. Click on it and it'll take us to this screen here. From this screen, head to the top right and go and click on that loop icon like this. And you then need to go and select files at the top here and click on browse from the files app like so. And then what you need to do is go and find the audio file you just extracted from the video. So mine is in recents and here it is. It's this one here. You can always click on browse and go and find it that way though. So I'm going to click on it just here and it's now going to appear shortly in this list just like that. And then all you need to do is hold your finger on it and then just sort of drag it. And it then should bring you back to this page here. And then what you want to do is just go and click on it and then drag it just so it's right at the start like this. Now you may want to go and trim this because maybe you don't want the start or the end. So then all you need to do is go and place your finger on that line there and then go and start dragging it like so. And there we go, I've now removed the start and then what I can do is go and click on it and then go and drag it to the start again, just like so. So it's super easy. So once you've trimmed it and got it to how you want it to be, then go to the top left and click on that downwards facing icon like that and click on my songs and it will go and sort of say saving or something. And now it's been added there as my song nine. But then what you need to do is go and hold your finger on it like so. You'll see this screen and then you can scroll down and go and click on share just here and then select ringtone. And you can then go and name it. So I'm going to go and name this video audio and I'll then click on export in the top right. Once it's finished, it will say export successful and I can go and click OK like that. And that's it. Now we can come out of GarageBand. We'll go into our phone settings, then scroll down to sounds and haptics just here and then select ringtone. And it's going to go and appear at the top here. As you can see, video audio, I can go and click on it and I can now go and hear the video sound, which I want it to be my ringtone. It's that simple. 